Ergometer to me paddle for many years, but, but only, I guess, five or seven years have they really come into dominance in kayaking. But I think with the event that we have here, it's so stimulating, it's lights, the camera, action, roll them. I think that, you know, it's very exciting. Together with the music, you know, it just, it gives you adrenaline and, uh, you know, it can give you a real um, insight into what canoeing can be. It's a really exciting event to come to. It's not often that you get to a race where you can walk out with smoke and lights behind you in, in front of a, a crowd of people and there's that much more hype about it. And also you've got a whole range of people here from the sort of bottom end of the sport right up to the top. So it's pretty exciting to be in that environment. It, it was wonderful because the, there is a lot of people and they are so close to the, the podium. So it, it was so personal. <laughs> It's strange because you're racing but you don't have a good perception of where you are in the field so you don't know if you're leading, if you're last or anywhere in between. But um, other than that, it's, yeah, it's good, solid. Um, I think the event's been really fantastic. I think the turnout yesterday was absolutely phenomenal. The atmosphere's been great. Everybody's been really encouraging. Um, I, I personally haven't been to something like this. I wasn't sure what to expect, but it's been a really, really great event. And as I said, yesterday was phenomenal. And we had um, lots of interest, specifically for Ontario. And the compare was great, the lighting was great. It's a really, really good event so far. Ontario um, is very probably most synonymous with icons such as Niagara Falls, um, CN Tower and Toronto. But I'm not sure how much awareness there is as a whole for for the province as a whole and the many outdoor activities that are available. I mean, this is one key thing that we are hoping to push in the future. Um, we really saw this event as um, a great opportunity and a great synergy to promote the many water activities within the province. Um, I think being on, the, being on the stage, having everyone right there is quite a different experience. Like, normally there's a big crowd there and you can like, you get all the cheering, but you can kind of just concentrate on your lane, whereas it's a lot more like, oh, there's cameras in front of me. And, the main thing you're thinking about is not filling any silly faces. We love coming to events like this and personally, for me, I can't comment the others, but I get a real buzz from, from seeing the depth of the sport. We only ever see the elite level normally and so when you come here and you see all these youngsters feeding into the, the kind of the bottom of the chain that I know in 10 years time they're going to be, they're going to be kicking me out of the team. So it, it's fantastic to see and, and long may it continue and events like this that inspire that. This event is the poster child for indoor kayaking. Um, with the BCU and with our sponsors here, Ontario, we have developed a situation here that, you know, this, this is what it should be like. This is what everybody was hoping for and everybody envisaged. And really, it's, it's, it's rewriting the book in terms of what is possible and what is achievable. Um, and I think this concept can go all the way around the world. It's exciting. It's, you know, it's miraculous what, what we're doing here and we're just writing the book in terms of what is possible and what is achievable with this.